Welcome to Morrison Homes and welcome to your new home. I'm JD, the warranty tech. I'd like to take you through and show you how to maintain your home. Here we have our heat recovery ventilator, otherwise known as the HRV. This box here is hanging off with four straps. It has two clips at the top to open the door. We open this door and if the recovery ventilation system is running, not to worry, the switch will turn it off. There's two scroll cage fans on either side. Careful not to put your fingers in there. Inside here we have our filters. So this is the in-house filter. As you can see, it's getting a little bit dirty, but it's not too bad. You simply take your vacuum, you vacuum it off, and then take it over to the sink and rinse it under the sink. Let it dry out for an hour, put it back in. Do the same on the other side. This is the intake from the outside of the house. As you can see, there's a lot of dust and dirt and some debris, as well as there's gonna be some bugs and mosquitoes, just to give you a warning. Lastly, we have the main exchanger box. This box actually comes out. I'll show you. Take the filters off. Pull this box right out. It can be a little stiff sometimes. And then you can see that it has some dirt on it. Simply take it outside, hose it off, or take it into your shower and rinse it off. You do this twice a year or every six months. Set the unit back inside. Slide it in carefully. Place your filters back on top and close the box. The HRV system will then kick back in and go through its regular cycles on its own. Again, we do this about every three months. We have one of our HRV filters. Simply turn on the tap and run it under the water. Try to spray evenly as you can. Do it on both sides. And all that debris and dirt will just simply rinse off. Now it does hold a lot of water, but please refrain from trying to wring it out. Just let it sit and drip dry within the sink. Give that about an hour, maybe a bit of a shake, and then you can put it back into your HRV system.